realize that the future is always for the believer. Victory is always written for the believer. If not in this world, then definitely in the next world. Allah says in the Quran, after the defeat of Uhud, the Muslims walked back feeling very depressed, very down. And Allah said to them, وَلَا تَهِنُوا وَلَا تَعْزَنُوا وَأَنْتُمُ الْأَعْلَوْنَ إِن كُنْتُمْ مُؤْمِنِينَ Don't feel weak and don't feel sad. You shall be the winners if you have iman. So it is true, brothers and sisters, that Iman isn't the only solution to depression. And I say this at least 10 times in today's khutbah. But it is also true that generally speaking, good family, good community, good friends, and most importantly, good Iman, they help. Sometimes they don't solve. Sometimes you need to go beyond this. Sometimes you need therapy. Sometimes you need medication. But never, never will Iman harm you. Never will it get in the way of you and curing any problem. There is no question that all of these points that we mentioned will help a person. And in many cases, not all, in many cases solve anxiety and depression and sometimes people have to go beyond that and that is where the trained therapists need to come in may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us of those who listen to the quran